Why do you bother building an audience from scratch when your competitors are already doing all the work for you? In this video, I'm going to show you three ways to steal your competitors' audience on LinkedIn by getting their company page followers, their post commenters, and their event attendees. So let's dive right in with the first technique. So the first technique is to get the followers of your competitors' company page. So for that, you are going to create a fake LinkedIn account go into this account and create a fake job experience into uh, your competitor's company. So for example, here I've created a fake account and created a job experience in this company here. And after that, you are going to need sales navigator. So you got a 30 day free trial if you want to try the tool. So once you have that, you can click on sales now here, go on lead filter, and then scroll down to spotlight here, click here and select the filter following your company. And here you're going to have all the followers of the company page displaying here. If you are double checking, if I click here on the company logo, you can see that this company has more than 10,000 followers. And here I can see more than 2000 followers here also. And the good thing about sales navigator is that you can have filters on top of that. So for example, let's say I just want uh, the heads off. Like I want decision makers among the followers. So no, I just need to write head off and hold the heads off will be displayed here. So you can have all the followers, but you can also um, add filters on top of that to create a really curated uh, list of leads the person that interests you the most. So once you have your list ready, you can use the Evaboot Chrome extension to extract it into a CSV and find the emails of these leads. So for that, just need to download the Evaboot Chrome extension. I've left the link in the description. And once you have that set up, you have this button here, extract with Evaboot, and just need to click on it, little loading screen, and then Evaboot will open a new window. And you just need to write here, company page followers, for example, in here, click on extract leads and Evaboot will get all this lead into a clean CSV. Then after a few minutes, you get uh, your result here. So you can download the file by clicking here. So you will get first name, last name, company name, company website, uh, job position, job description, number of followers. So a ton of uh, LinkedIn data, which is really interesting. And if you want the emails as well, you can click on find emails here and Evaboot will add the professional emails of all these people. Once you have your CSV and the emails, you can start reaching out to these people manually or upload the file into your favorite outreach tool. And I've left a template to contact the company page followers in the article that is in the description. So feel free to check it if you want some inspiration for your outreach messages. Now let's get to the second technique, stealing your competitors, posts, commenters, and likers. So for this technique, we are going to take as an example, one of my posts. Uh, which I've made to announce that Evaboot was now finding emails. So this post got more than 100 likes and a little less than 50 comments. And on this comment, there are people that, you know, are interested by uh, trying the email finder. So potentially if I an email finder as well, I want to contact these people and tell them that I have also a product potentially better than uh, this one. So what I can do here is to um, copy the URL of the post here and use a tool called File on Blaster. So I will leave the link in the description as well. And go here on Solution, LinkedIn, and then here write Post uh, Commenters. So here I got two um actions i can do so extract the post commenters or the post likers so for this one i'm going to do the post likers but you can do both click on use this phantom here uh, you need to install the chrome extension so i will quickly do that oh and here you had your cookies and then you are just going to uh, copy paste the url of the, the, the linkedin post here and then there is a few settings like remove duplicates, watch your mode. Okay, so we are not interested about that. Uh, launch manually, known. Basically, you can skip everything and then click on launch here. And here, Photopus Store is going to extract all people that have liked this post. And you're going to have all the first name, last name, uh, job position, and LinkedIn URL into a CSV. 
Once the scrapping is finished, you can uh, preview the CSV here and you can see here LinkedIn URL, name, job title, um, degree of connection, first name, etc. And then you can then download the CSV and same thing. You can reach out to these people, find their emails, etc. And I also left a template for output messages in the uh, first comment uh, where is the full article about this topic. So you can use this technique when you see like uh, some post happening in your feed. That's why this is really important to follow all your competitors and the people in your niche because maybe you will find some opportunities while you are scrolling LinkedIn. And the timing here uh, is really important because let's say one of your competitors is making a post and then two days later you start um, reaching out to people. Um, the memory will be fresh in the head of your prospect so they will know what you are talking about. Because if you start the outreach two weeks after the post, they will completely forget that they have liked or commented the post. So you better be really reactive for this type of outreach. Um, if you want to look for posts, you can also use the LinkedIn search. So let's say I want to look for posts about you know, lead generation. I can uh, write my keyword here and click on post. And here I'm going to have all the posts containing the keywords lead generation. So potentially I can do the same thing, copy link to the post, uh, put it in front of Burster and do the same thing. And here I can potentially, you know, scroll uh, to find interesting posts. And um, I can filter on past 24 hour and past week. Here, let's say, you know, past 24 hour to have really fresh posts and then, you know, have this timing effect when I'm sending my outreach campaigns. Once again, you can do it manually or use your favorite outreach tool. Now let's get to the third technique, stealing your competitor's event attendees. The third technique is pretty similar to the second one. So the first step is to look for LinkedIn events organized by your competitors or someone in your niche. And for that, we are going to use the LinkedIn search. So and again, let's write lead generation and click on events. Here, and then let's scroll down a little bit and let's say, you know, I know I'm a cold email software. Here I got a webinar inside to email lead generation and I got 123 attendees. So obviously a really qualified audience for my business. If I um, building a cold email automation tool, for example, and the only thing I need to do here is to click on attend here. And then I will get access to all the people attending to this event. So you can, you can see that now this button is unlocked and I can see all these people and send them direct messages. I don't even need to be connected to them. But here, what we are going to do is to um, copy paste this URL here and go back to bottombuster.com, click on solution, LinkedIn, write events, and select the LinkedIn event guest export, use this phantom, connect to LinkedIn, and then boom, just copy paste the URL here. So there is like a maximum, I don't know uh, what is the limit here, um, but let's say 150 and uh, number max like okay. so save manually none save and then launched. So as you can see, you might not be able to extract all the attendees uh, in one uh, in one launch in one scaling. You may have to to launch it several times, but front of still can manage that for you. So let's launch here the scrapping and wait for the results. So here the extraction is finished and I can also, you know, preview the file and you'll have LinkedIn URL, full name, first name, last name, title and degree of connection. And once again, I can take this list, uh, find the emails and launch uh, an outreach campaign on these people. I've also left an outreach template in the first comment of this video. And by the way, this is completely free. You don't need to pay for a frontal booster to uh, do what I've just done. The notion of timing here is also really important because you can choose to reach out to these people before the event, uh, like 
asking them why they are interested, why they want to participate to this event, or reaching out to them after the event, asking them if they have enjoyed the event. And let's say, for example, uh, they reply, you know, I know the event was not so good. This is a golden opportunity for you to, you know, present your service or your product because, you know, the person just have been disappointed by one of your competitors. So this is a golden opportunity for you to prove that your product or your service is better. Little bonus for you guys, you can also do the same thing with groups. So let's say your competitor has created a LinkedIn group. You can also write keywords um, and look for LinkedIn groups here and for number still, they also get uh, something to extract group members. So here, LinkedIn group member export here. So you need to be part of the group to extract the group members. So first you need to, you know, uh, so I'm a member of this group, so I will have no trouble extracting the list. But if you are not a member of the group, you need to first, you know, send a request and you need your request to be accepted to be able to uh, extract the members. But the thing is, uh, most LinkedIn groups are totally inactive or full of spam. So I, I doubt you will find good opportunities here because I don't know any active uh, LinkedIn group with a good community, you know, posting every day, etc. But maybe you have one in your niche. So, you know, I'm telling that in case you have found the only LinkedIn group active on LinkedIn, send me a message if you do. <laughs> and remember, if you are just starting your business, you don't need to build your audience from scratch. Your audience actually already exists on platforms like LinkedIn, Facebook, Reddit, Slack communities, etc. So just go find them where they are already present and you will see that it will be much easier than starting from scratch. If you want more LinkedIn hacks, I advise you to check this video here about how to bypass the new LinkedIn weekly limitation on connection request. As you know, you can now only send 100 invitations per week. And in this video, I show you how to send 300, 400, 500 even. Uh, invitation per week using three acts. So make sure to check the video if you are interested by this topic. See you guys. Bye-bye.